Do you know what it is? Wednesday. And do you know what that means? Brand new episode of Visible Panty Lines. Mm -hmm. I'm Hank Chen. I'm Hilary Rushford. And it is summertime in New York City. It is hot, hot, hot. Woo. Indeed. And the style challenge when it comes to summer is how do you make your outfits interesting when it is way too hot to pull off that J. Crew look of 29 layers on top of each other? Sing a girlfriend. Lunches. The answer is accessories. Cheap, easy way to add a lot of color and a lot of personality into a very simple, very lightweight outfit. Yes, as I heard someone say, it's like putting the exclamation point on a very short sentence. Smart. Let's take a look at some runway and street style shots, see what works and what doesn't. So first up is hats. I love, love, love hats. Absolutely. I've said it a million times before. They keep the sun off your face, cover your hair when you're having a bad hair day, and they look super cute. Lots of room for style, lots of creativity. It doesn't make you any hotter from the neck down. Exactly. Gladiator sandals. Unless you are Russell Crowe, don't try to pull this off. <laughs> Well, see, I think it's a great way to add visual interest on your feet because in the winter, you can't see your shoes. So yeah. I say play and have some fun. Speaking of more footwear, colored shoes, all about it in summer. Most of my winter shoes mm -hmm. are black, brown, and gray. Yeah. Summer is when you get to wear all your heels and your ballet flats. So, Let it pop, yeah. yeah. Bracelets, I think bracelets are awesome. I think simple jewelry in general for men and for women can really add to an outfit. Add some shine, some shimmer, and some color to your body. Yeah, and I'm actually a fan of chunky jewelry mm. in summer because yes. I feel like if you have a simple, thin silhouette going on in an outfit, you can balance that out with one great statement piece. So we've seen a few summer accessories on the runway that would be a throwback to eras gone by, 70s, 80s, old people stuff. <laughs> but they are making a resurgence, so let's take a look to see if it works or if it doesn't. I call this segment Approach with Caution. Absolutely. <laughs> so we're gonna start with granny scarves. Really gotta be careful with these. If you're yeah. wearing a cute A-line dress, you can't throw more cuteness on it. It's no. like dumping way too much sugar into your coffee. Yeah. yeah. Colorful brooches, uh, one at a time on a very structured shirt, dress, or blazer. We saw these turbans on what the, the Mark hell are Jacobs these? runway. It, it makes me feel like it's like a 1980s ski bunny movie where like some model ends up dead by the end or something. It's not, it doesn't say anything about <laughs> summer to me. It doesn't say turb, it looks like a ski bunny hat. It's awful. Okay, so wedge sneakers. It's kind of a throwback to that sports trend that's sort of coming back. This is a Marc Jacobs. It's a model look that stays on the runway and is not applicable to real people. You either need to be in running shoes yeah. or you need to be in high heels. Yeah, it's like top model meets survivor, <sighs> which is really no one's everyday life. <laughs> yeah. Visors, if you're coming to meet me at brunch, don't, don't wear, wear a visor. No, don't do it. Not, not in New York, you look no. stupid. Not anywhere. <laughs> no. One thing that I am obsessed with is accessories. That's right. Primarily because they're so inexpensive. One example of this, leopard print. I've got a lot of clients that would be nervous to wear a full leopard dress or blouse, but something like a pair of flats or a chunky bangle, you can dabble in this trend without having to drop a lot of cash on it. Okay, bright makeup. Well, you know, since you're wearing so little to begin with, it's okay to dress up your face just a little bit with more color. And yeah. from what I hear from guys who are into girls, they do notice eyes and lips first. So yeah, why not attract that attention if you're game for it. Colored sunglasses, great way to try, say, the neon trend. You don't yeah. want to buy a whole hot pink dress. Try sunglasses, see how it works with your skin tone. Yeah, literally you can see the world in rose-colored glasses because your lenses are pink, so. It's cute. And nail art. It is okay during the summertime to dress yourself up from the tips of your fingers to your toes, you know? Absolutely. And neon is definitely very in this year. Why not play around with it? And the great thing about nail art, just like clothes or glasses or a scarf, you can take it off in the day if it doesn't work out for you. Well, that was a whole list of hashtag VP loves, but there are still things we don't necessarily agree with. So let's go right into it. Hashtag VP leaves everything on this list. Yeah, I'm gonna just say no to these summer trends. First up is giant platform sandals. I fell off of these all the time. Oh my God. I'm constantly rolling my ankle. So do a sensible little wedge and call it a day. In plastic shoes, just think about this. Your sweaty foot is in a plastic shoe. I mean, it's an incubator for bacteria, foot fungus, and just all kinds of stank, and it just looks ugly. For accessories in the summer, okay. never okay. It just it's makes me sad. It's so hot outside. Why in the world would you want fur anywhere? 
near you. No. Now is not the time or the place. Yeah, no, I have a dog, his name is Eli, he's black, he's Jewish, and I could not, in good faith, carry around anything fur. Yeah, even if it's faux fur, in the summer, to have that, I feel like it's gonna start to smell like wet dog, like as you're getting sweaty and just, hashtag VP leave, all Ooh. over the place. Well, that was our roundup on summer accessories here on VPO. We hope you guys are having an amazing summer. Follow us on Twitter, Hankster Chen and Hillary Rushford. And leave us in the comments below what your tips are for getting through summer in style. I personally like to lay out in my patio naked in a bucket of ice water next to my dog. In a bucket of ice water? Mm -hmm. I, I make it work. Wait, I make it happen. Can I come over? Oh, wait, wait, you said you're naked. Never mind. I don't want to come over. <laughs> or I'll do use you. it when you're gone. Or do you? I don't. Or do you? Or do you? <laughs> Or do you? <laughs> My dog's there. Play with the dog. I'll wear a blindfold and play with you. <laughs>